MTN Sports Grace Lawrence here at Bobcat Stadium where number two ranked Montana State will be hosting Cal Poly on Saturday. The Bobcats are coming off a bye week, something that really benefited them heading into this latter half of the schedule. Players who have been out with injury were able to have that extra week of rest to recover and officially return this weekend. Yeah, it, it has been nice. Um, in the past, we've had our bye week pretty late, and so it's, it's a really, really long stretch before our bye week. Um, and so it was nice. I felt like it was needed. Um, it, was, it was very nice to have that in the middle um, to kind of separate into where now we can get into a mindset of um, getting ready to make this run towards the playoffs. So. I think where we're at this year, it, it suited us better. Um, week six, you know, when you're you're going through a week where you don't play and you're you're wanting guys to return to have one of those weeks be a, a week where you don't have a game I think is a good thing. One of the injured players returning this Saturday is quarterback Tommy Malott. Listed as an or on the depth chart, his number of snaps may be limited, but he will be available. Tommy Malott is a highly tuned uh, athlete when he's when he's healthy and, and getting him kind of back to that uh, that place, you know, as you know, when you're immobile for a couple weeks, um, you know, that's that's the progress I guess we're continuing to make, but definitely available at this point. Cal Poly, currently 0-3 in Big Sky Conference play, will be heading into arguably their toughest match yet on the road against the Cats in Bozeman. For Montana State, it's about staying dialed in to the game in front of them. Week by week, you've got to focus on your own opponent. You can't really take anything lightly. You can't take them lightly for sure. Um, they're a good team, they're disciplined, and they, they have new coaches, so they're a hungry team and they're young. I think we look at it as just another week. Um, we talk about every single game counting the same at the end of the season, uh, so no matter uh, no matter what, this game's going to be in our record, um, and so we, we don't treat it like any um, any different than any other game. So I think the, the preparation is the same every single week for us. So. For the Bobcats, something that's been on display every week is how in sync the units on both sides of the ball are with one another, something they've continuously worked on. Especially the communication side of things. Uh, last year, I know we wanted to communicate better, and I feel like that's what we're doing this year. Um, as long as we're all right, we're all wrong, and we're all on the same page and the look to carry that high level of communication and connection into Saturday. Kickoff is at 6 p.m. on your MTN channel. In Bozeman, Grace Lawrence, MTN Sports.